Miguel, you look down. What's up, man? You know, I just want to be tall, Dr. B. My head is going forward. My last physical, they said I've lost an inch uh, of my height. And I mean, I'm already short as it is. I just, just want to get tall. And I mean, I know that we've talked about the polar dart advance um, and how they help induce natural curvature of the neck. And when we're doing this, you know, we can put them in three different areas, the lower part of the region, your yes, no, maybes, right? Right. And then, you know, also moving them up through the middle section, same thing, and then up on the on the upper region as well. But okay. I, just, I want to get taller. I I uh, I hear what you're saying. Uh, a lot of times with uh, you know putting space into those joints, the adjustment really helps with that. The traction that we do helps to basically, for lack of other terms, stretch out that spine, put space into those. Uh, the, the disc space is there. You know, it helps to hydrate the disc as well. Some of the exercises we have you do helps helps with that as well. Um, and so, you know, don't lose hope. There's there's a lot of lot of great things that we can do for you. I mean, what's well, I think it's been helping so far. I think y'all are doing a great job. Keep up the good work. Hey guys, Dr. Dash here, Wellness Key Chiropractic. Uh, this Mindful Monday is all about preparation. This coming Sunday, I know, a week away. This coming Sunday. Put it in your calendar, put it on your phone. Sunday, before you go to bed, plan out your next week. Whether it be groceries, whether it be meals, your workouts, things that, that, that are important to you, put them in your schedule, how you want them done, and that way those things happen no matter what. So as life gets crazy and busy, and it does, those things are gonna happen, and you know they're gonna happen, you can count on them happening throughout the week. I'm Dr. Utash, Wellness Key Chiropractic. Plan out your week this Sunday. struggled with sciatic pain, sciatic nerve, really pinching, giving you some really bad pain, you're limping, you're falling, anything that kind of is really tremendously affecting your lower back or your right hand side of your back, um, then I have a thing for you. We would love to have you come in and bring your friends, anything you want to get them in. Sorry, sorry. It's okay. Take your time. We had a patient actually. She was having really struggle. She was struggling with sciatic pain pretty badly. She came in. We've done. We've had her here for about ten visits. She's already seeing a major improvement in her sciatic pain, which is a really big deal for a lot of people who are struggling with that. It's not fun. If you have it, you definitely understand what it feels like. So if you have any questions for the doctor about that, what that feels like, let him know. If you want to bring someone in that's struggling with that, bring them on in. Get them adjusted. We'd love to take care of them. Once we've gotten a little bit more under control, you're gonna start feeling a lot better. Feeling a lot happier, a lot more upbeat, a lot less of that pinching of the nerve. So if you have any questions about that, you let us know, just like this gentleman. Look at him, he's brand new. Bring someone in, refer a friend. Thirty. Ugh. All right, this week's exercise, crunches. I know it's like 1980s gym style, but crunches. Get them in right away in the morning. So before you go potty, before you do anything, kick out the pillow, kick out anything from underneath you, and just old school crunches, just like I was doing, just activating the core muscles, moving the spine. It's gonna wake you up, it's gonna increase proprioception. Do 30 of them every day this week. Dr. Right Utash, Wellness Key Chiropractic, core exercises, crunches every Wednesday at 4.45 for half an hour. Done. Adjustment. Oh, I have the perfect emoji for this. Uh, this little guy getting her neck adjusted. And I'm gonna repeat that every week. Cool. Oh, hey! Just uh, scheduling my weekly adjustments with Dr. Utash and Dr. B. The best way for me to remember my appointments is to put it in my calendar. I'm trying to get better at that, you know, schedule everything, make sure I'm keeping on top of all my appointments. So if you're kind of like me and you tend to forget what you have going on when, that's a great way. Set up your appointments weekly on the same days, the same times. That way it's just automatically popping up 
oh look I have this reminder every Wednesday at 4 45 I'm going to get adjusted and you can even put your own little emoji whatever one works best for you um, if you have any questions about your schedule or are interested in setting up a more regular schedule, let Sheree know. She can set up the whole month, a whole two months worth of appointments if you kind of have a regular schedule moving forward. Um, we're, the more we can schedule you out in advance, the better we can make sure that the schedule is spread out so that not too many people are getting in here at the same time, which should help to reduce the wait time that you have here in the office. Uh, also, just make sure that you're bringing that little key tag to every appointment. If for some reason you don't have it, uh, we do have an option to sign in with your phone number. A lot of people have been asking me, what is the PIN? So if the computer asks you for the PIN, like you're on table five, uh, or you need to use the iPad to sign in, that's always gonna be your phone number. No area code if you have a 520 area code, but make sure you do include your area code if you're from out of town. Um, so that would be then your full number as your PIN number. Uh, and we assign that here in your account, so it should be ready to go for you. If you have any questions, please let us know. We're always here to help. Have a great week. Uh, this week, I really wanna to talk to you about the power of having a vision, of having you know a goal uh, that's more than just a goal. Uh, so I'm sitting outside this office right now and you know five years ago we had been coming to the loop and we were practicing just a couple miles down the street and we saw this building and we loved it and it was you know it was at that time it was for a lease things just didn't work out even though we tried to try to get a lease in this building it didn't happen but we kept coming here we kept seeing this i kept peeking in the windows like a creeper all of this going in our head like man i can just see myself in this office i know this is the place that i want to be it just wasn't the right time. About a year goes by and we were able to get a lease on the, on, the, uh, on the building and we wanted to purchase it, but the person that owned it, he just wasn't having it. And so it, it just wasn't going our way at that time. But we're like, you know what? We want this place. We love it. We'll, we'll even sign a lease for it. And, and we did so. And all of this, it was like trial, no, 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 kind of closer we wanted. And here we are almost three years later, we had the opportunity uh, during the pandemic to, to purchase the building that we never had the opportunity before four years prior and it all started with in our head hey i can see us uh and i say us my family wellness key owning uh this building for wellness key to operate out of close to the loop where people can walk after their adjustment they can get the exercise it's a bigger facility it has more options for the inside for patients and it's something that we just kept running over and over and over in our head and it was just a reticular activated system just making it happen and when the opportunity came about we are ready to jump on it uh, to purchase uh, to purchase this so maybe it's a goal maybe it's something that you see for your life maybe it's your health maybe it's your finances uh, no matter what it is having that goal having that vision and you know i can't tell you how many times we pulled into these parking spots peeked in the windows walked around the building hoping and praying that this was going to be ours and here we are four or five years later and it is it can happen we are an example of that i hope that that happens for you as well hey guys uh a lot of people ask me you know what can i do naturally for uh crusty eyes dry eyes irritated eyes especially due to allergens um the thing that we use in our family is colloidal silver uh and so uh, this is something that you can purchase at Sprouts, at Whole Foods, Natural Grocers. Uh, this one in particular has uh, uh, 10 parts per million, I believe it's, uh, the name is Sovereign Silver. Uh, something that, that really, I, I, I'll drop even in my one-year-old's eyes with really no, no issues whatsoever. Uh, we've been doing this for years, uh, both for myself and uh, for my children. Um, I think it's uh, absolutely safe to put in your eyes uh, and that seems to help quite a bit with uh, some of the eye irritation, even the red eyes, even if it, for like strained eyes, uh, this seems to help quite a bit. It's uh, safe and natural. So hope this helps. Colloidal silver for the eyes, 10 parts per million. Uh, it's what we use in the Utash family. In 2013, uh, there was a study that was done that said 37.8% of the U.S. population uh, had been prescribed an opioid, right? We have a problem, guys. We have a huge problem. 59% of the opioids prescribed are for low back pain. Perhaps chiropractic could help with that. In fact, a 2014 study uh, was done on 14,000 veterans uh, with chronic pain. They found that one third of those veterans receiving chiropractic services also held an opioid prescription. Results determined that those people who received chiropractic care re reduced their intake of opioids after their first visit. Imagine that. 
It's a problem, right? 30% of foster kids in California are coming from an opioid addicted family. 75% of opioid addicts, heroin, fentanyl, all the crappy stuff that's coming across the border, it started because of prescribed opioids, right? We have a problem, chiropractic is a solution.